welcome to another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. My name is Derek Welker, and today we'll be discussing the freeze bar and the performance evaluation tool. Have you been working with a model that has a lengthy feature tree and noticed that it takes a while to rebuild the model? The performance evaluation tool allows you to determine which features are taking the most time to rebuild along with the total rebuild time. In this case, the total rebuild time is just over five seconds. Let me show you how you, we can reduce that number. You will notice that Cavity 4 is taking 3 quarters of a second to rebuild alone. There's a handful of other features that take roughly half a second to rebuild, including Mirror 1. This is relevant, relevant because we will identify the features that are taking the most time and exclude them from being rebuilt. This is where the freeze bar comes into play. The freeze bar is not on by default, so let's turn it on. Going into the tools options, it is right in the general tab at the bottom of the first selections, enable freeze bar. The freeze bar now appears at the top of our feature tree. The freeze bar works very similar to the rollback bar, except we are rolling it towards the bottom. What you will notice when I drop the freeze bar below cavity 4 is that every feature above the bar now has a padlock next to it. This signifies that the feature is locked and cannot be edited. edited. This also excludes the feature from being rebuilt. Let's continue dragging it down towards the mirror 1 feature. Once we have finished freezing the features, we will go back to the performance evaluation and check out the difference. Now it tells us that our total rebuild time with the freeze is less than a second. This makes working with this model much more enjoyable. Using the performance evaluation tool to identify the features with the lengthy rebuild times and excluding them with the freeze bar makes these tag team tools a perfect match. Hopefully you will take advantage of one of my favorite features with the freeze bar and performance evaluation tool. Thank you for watching another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. See you next week. Don't forget to check us out on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and our blog for more great content by clicking on the links in the description below.